Okay, I haven't done one of these for a while, so a review, and yes, it's not a Solomon bit of gear, which I know most of my reviews are, but these are the Black Diamond um, Distance Carbon FLZ poles. They are on the pricey side. I know there's a lot of other poles out there, but I always think the more you buy but pay for something, nine out of 10, you're getting what you pay for. So um, these are awesome bit of kit. I've used these many, many times. I know there's some pole haters out there and there's some people that love poles. I think they could have a place in, in running, especially uh, on high elevation type of trails. Uh, and you want a pair of poles that are really, really light. So these black diamond ones are perfect. I could put these on a pack and I wouldn't even feel like I'm wearing them. Um, or carried them, should I say, wearing them. Um, so let's move the camera so I can give you a better view. Okay, so like I said, these are the Black Diamond Carbon Distance Poles. So as you can see, really, really light. Um, they are broken down to three parts. So they are the foldable versions. Um, I actually think that's the only version they do, but um, again, it just helps ease them with uh, packing rather than just going sliding themselves into each other. Um, what they've done is they've added a bit of plastic around the rope. So normally on other poles that I've used in the past, sometimes that gets a little bit threadbare, especially when it starts to rub against the poles. Uh, so they've added these like flexible um, uh, plastic inserts, if you like, that go over it and uh, the, the, it, it stops it from getting damaged. Um, again, it's really, really adjustable. So when you get these, they have do have a size guide on them. Uh, so these ones are currently the 105 to 125 centimeters and this can be adjusted slightly to those two distances anywhere between that by this little clip like so so now hold on a two seconds quite hard to do so if i unclip that i can adjust the height of the pole to where i want it obviously there's loads of videos out there how to find the right height for you and then what they've done on the poles is they've added little distant markers as well so you can use them as a bit of a guide to be honest, once you've found it, you'll probably find you'll never adjust it again. And this will just stay clamped or locked in like so. Um, so to use the poles, again, really, really easy. All I've got to do is pull this together and I'm doing this with one hand. And what this will do is turn it into one big pole. Now there is a little push button there. So if I can just get it out, two seconds. Uh, there's a little button here which locks it all in and these poles are ready to go and be used. Um, and if I ever want to release it, all I've got to do is just one button press, press that down and then I'll be able to unlock the poles and fold them back away again. It's easy as that and you can easily do that on the move as well. Um, so look at the handle, again it's all Everything's carbon, 100%. Nice little grip on it. Um, obviously if it's cold weather you don't want anything hard plastics or metal on here obviously because your hands are free so i find these are really really good and especially when it's wet as well uh, i have no problems with this grip and it doesn't hurt my hands either um, again strap at the top for you to go around your wrist just in case you want to let go of the poles for whatever reason they're not going to go flying anywhere um, me personally i wish this was a little bit more adjustable uh, i like it a little bit tight because what i end up doing is i end up uh, twisting it to try and get a little bit more grip uh, well a bit more bit more support. I know it's not how you meant to use poles, but I, I just like a little bit more of a, a tighter grip, but that's just my personal opinion rather than uh, the in thing, if you like. Um, usual things at the end. Um, obviously you can change the tips of these ones to the rubber or um, as it is the stud, obviously for different types of terrain, uh, snow guard, mud guard, it's at the back. And that is it for the Black Diamond. So that is the Black Diamond um, carbon distant poles, FLZs, really, really good bit of kit. Uh, I've used other poles before and they either snap on some hikes, especially when I'm getting tired and I'm trying to put, put more body weight on it. Um, and I sometimes fold them away, they come undone, these don't. You can literally just pull them uh, tight, as you saw in the uh, previous on this video, uh, and off you go, which I, I think is brilliant. Uh, I don't know what else you can ask for on a, a pair of poles, if I'm being honest. And that's my review. 10 out of 10 for me, um, best poles out there for me. Uh, if anyone's looking for anything light, go for these, spend a bit of money on them uh, and you won't regret it. If there's anything on here that you're thinking about purchasing and you have a few questions, fire them at me at the comments below and I'll give you uh, some more videos towards it or some photos uh, that you might want to see. Uh, any questions you might have about anything to do with the polls, I, I, I don't mind answering for my own personal uh, use of these polls. Um, so yeah. Awesome purchase. Go and get them.